Okay, here we are in the 57 uh, Les Paul. This guitar has had the, the historic makeover touch to it, and that includes the, the contour of the body and the contour of the neck, making that to uh, vintage specs and uh, a refinish and the, the relative and the parts. So all that comes from uh, historic makeover. And it also has the Peter Frampton uh, wiring is done uh, to the guitar and it's set up just like Peter Frampton's uh, Phoenix. And it also has the uh, Tom Holmes pickups, just as Peter Frampton's uh, does. And I asked Tom Holmes to, uh, when he made the pickups for me, to uh, wire those just the same as uh, those in the Phoenix. And that's the way this guitar's been done. So we're going to go through the controls just to say a little bit about it. Today we're playing through a part, a 67 part, uh, with a, a two rock single 12 cabinet. And uh, to the controls of the guitar, the way it's set up, just as Peter Frampton's is set up, is that the, uh, you have a master volume that's dedicated just to the neck and the bridge pickup. So they work off the one volume and the one tone located here. So anytime you want to change the volume of the, and remember you're, you're manipulating the volume of both of these pickups, when you change this volume and you manipulate the tone of both those pickups when you change the tone. And then there's a dedicated volume and tone for the middle pickup so that you can blend that in and you can manipulate the tone of that pickup with this, this tone control. And that's always on. You just yeah, turn it's it off always, with the volume. Always the, the middle pickup is always on and to turn it off is you turn it off with this volume by just turning it all the way. And then the, the selector position. works the same as. And the selector works just the same. As a two pickup Les Paul. As a, a two pickup Les Paul would work. So a lot of variable uh, variations of tone that you can get from the guitar, so. You can actually get any individual pickup or any combination of pickups, one, two, or three. Yeah. So we'll demonstrate that a little bit. We'll start with the neck pickup and with just the next pickup only, nothing else on in the tone open. So. set the guitar up just as it would be if it was a, a, a regular Les Paul 2 pickup. These two pickups are on. I've eliminated the middle pickup by turning it all the way to the off position and just set in the volume for these two pickups and it sounds like this. sound like you don't have all three pickups going. Which I might say when you do that it really makes a huge sound and then you can start and just 
manipulate the tone by changing the, the, the volumes of the, of the pickups. So now, let me turn the middle pickup back off to where we want to have the bridge pickup. So here's the bridge pickup. And we'll add a little bit of reverb with oh. OCD. A little bit of overdrive. Overdrive. A little yeah. bit of overdrive with OCD. And we'll calm them. Pick up down just a little bit, but turn the tone down just a little. And it sounds a little bit like this. <laughs> It's a magnificent guitar. I would rather keep it, but I purchased a, a 58 um, vintage Les Paul uh, Black Beauty Custom. And I hate to part with this because, especially because of the wiring, but especially because of the pickups. That just sounds so good. The guitar started out life as a really good guitar and it's just been made a lot better. And I think you'll be happy, more than happy, and I don't think you're going to find a lot of guitars out there like this. This is a lot different from what the custom shop is doing and what has been done before with this guitar because this is as close as you're going to get to having a real vintage uh, Les Paul Black Beauty with free pickups and also having the opportunity to have the Peter Frampton wiring set up and pickups that are in the Frampton guitar. So good luck to all you bidders. And I, I hope you enjoy the guitar as much as I have, because I really have. And goodbye, friend.